Continue to worship the Lord. He is our source of survival. Without Him, we cannot survive. So let us worship Him. That's all He asks us to do: just to live for Him and to worship Him. For those persons who came in after we started, a holy and blessed season to you. Please feel welcome. I see some Jambanians in our midst. Please feel welcome. Bless the Lord. Our, we go to our scripture reading, and it's taken from St. Luke chapter 2, and we'll be reading from verse 4 to verse 20. Can you find it? Can you say amen? St. Luke 2. Reading from verse 4 to verse 20. And it reads thus. And Joseph also went up from Galilee, out of the city of Nazareth, into Judea, unto the city of David, which is called Bethlehem, to be taxed with Mary, his espoused wife, being great with child. And so it was that while they were there, the days were accomplished that she should be delivered. And she brought forth her firstborn son and wrapped him in swaddling clothes and laid him in a manger because there was no room for them in the inn. And there were in the same country shepherds abiding in the field, keeping watch over their flock by night. And lo, the angel of the Lord came upon them, and the glory of the Lord shone round about them, and they were sore afraid. And the angel said unto them, Fear not, for behold, I bring you good tidings of great joy, which shall be to all people. For unto you is born this day in the city of David a Savior, which is Christ the Lord. And this shall be a sign unto you. Ye shall find the babe wrapped in swaddling clothes 
lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a multitude of the heavenly host praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace, goodwill toward men. And it came to pass, as the angels were gone away from them into heaven, the shepherds said on one to another, Let us now go even unto Bethlehem, and see the thing which is come to pass, which the Lord hath made known unto us. And they came with haste, and found Mary and Joseph, and the babe lying in a manger. And when they had seen it, they made known abroad the saying which was told them concerning this child. And all that heard it wondered at those things which were told them by the shepherds. But Mary kept all these things and pondered them in her heart. Twenty and last, and the shepherds returned glorifying and praising God for all the things that they had heard and seen, and it was told unto them. Here is a portion of God's holy word. We honor it by saying, thanks be to God. We're now going to tune the hymn, Heart the Herald Angels Sing. It's not in the banner hymn, so please, if you don't know the words, pay attention to this theme from this hymn. Heart the herald angels sing, glory to the newborn King. Peace on earth and mercy mark, God and sinners reconciled. Joyful all in nation
with us as we worship and adore his name. Please stand. We are all going to pray. Bless the Lord. I'll now invite the PRO to come and do the official welcome. Let's praise the Lord. Good morning, everyone, and a pleasant welcome to all. My name is Dorita Smith Forsyth, and I'm on today's PR. For many, this past year has been one of challenges, and even for the most blessed of us, there have been ways that we could be successful. If you are struggling, if you feel like you're walking a hopeless path during this Christmas season, have faith. Cast your gaze towards Jesus. Remember that God loves you and can bring hope into any situation. The very essence of the Christmas season is one of hope and renewal. Jesus died on the cross for our sins so that we may experience salvation. That promise of salvation brings hope even into the dark situation. God loves us so much that he gave us his only son. With the knowledge that hope, with the knowledge of that love comes hope. Let me first take this opportunity to welcome and acknowledge our host pastor, Pastor Michael A. Robinson, his wife, Christine Robinson, and their son, Michael and Christine Robinson. My brothers and sisters in Christ, and also our visiting friends, both online and in person. And on that note, if you are visiting us for the first time or it has been a while, A pleasant welcome to you all. We want to thank everyone for taking the time out to come and worship with us. And also remember, during this season of celebration and reflection, remember Jeremiah 29 verse 11. For I know the plan, for I know the plans I have for you, says the Lord. Plans to prosper you and not to 
morning. I plan to give you hope and the future. As we celebrate this day, I invite you to open your heart to the hope that you can find in the good news. Thank you. Have a great day. Thank you, Sister Forsyth. Um, another bit of information for you. On January 14th, which is second Sunday of January, we'll be having our pastor and family appreciation right here, church. I am, you're going to, your leaders, your auxiliary leaders, like Sister Chambers for Children, Sister Nellon for Women's Ministry, Sister Danet for Youth Ministry, and his brother Stephen Gordon for the Men's Ministry will get in touch with you. If they miss and didn't get in touch with you, please get in touch with them. They are the ones who are going to direct you on what they are going to do and what you have to do for the appreciation. Please, rem please remember, it's January 14th. This is second Sunday. Thank you. You remain seated as we are going to sing Joy to the World and ask Stephen Hines and Brother Dean to collect the days, tithes, and offering. It's on the screen, but it's not in the banner here. Joy to the World. Joy to the world, the Lord has come. Let earth receive the King. Let every heart prepare him move. And heaven and nature sing. And heaven and nature sing. And heaven and heaven and nature sing. Joy to the earth, the Savior reigns. Let men their songs and flow. While fields and clouds, rock fields and caves, repeat the sound in joy, repeat the sound in joy, repeat, repeat the sound in joy. No more let seas and sorrows go, nor thorns infest the ground. He comes to make his blessings go, far as the earth is found, far as the earth is found, far as, far as the earth is found. He rules the world with truth. And makes the nations prove the glories of his righteousness and wonders of his love and wonders of his love and one and wonders. 
Praise the Lord. We'll ask Stephen Hines to ask God's blessings on the tithes and offering. Praise the Lord. Bless the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Father, again this morning, we thank the Lord for our, our presence, O oh God, in the house of prayer this morning. Father, as we come to worship the Lord, O God, that our heart would be the right place of worship this morning, O God, to honor you and to glorify you and to God. Father, we thank you this morning, O God, for the hope of our promise, O God, of salvation. Jesus, help us, O God, that we work towards the future of our hope in you, Jesus Christ, knowing that you, O God, have promised to faithful to that which you have spoken, Lord. Father, we thank you for this offering this morning as we call it the hand of the Lord. We ask for the blessing upon the Holy Spirit. Thank you, Deacon Hines. I am going to take this opportunity to ask, to call Brother Seymour to come. He's here with his family. We're going to ask him to come and to meet us. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise God. God has been good and I can't complain. Amen. As I was coming, um, so I was trying to catch the service on Sunday. But nevertheless, we went to Montego Bay Church and hoping that we could catch the service also at the start early. But I Remember the last message I preached the Sunday and I left the Friday. And the message was, God will take care of you. And I've been watching the services, I tell you, but when it comes on Sunday, and when they do a rebroadcast on Monday or Tuesday, I watch the service. And I can tell you that God has been taking care of you. Amen. You have a dynamic pastor. Amen, Pastor Robinson. Oh, bless the Lord. When I see him preaching, he's preaching out all of his heart. Amen. Delivering the word of God. My ministry team is with me, my wife and daughter. Um, for those who don't know her, please stand, Dahlia. And my daughter is in the back, Marcy. She left here when she was three months old. I think they, they come to Jamaica more often than I do. But I give God thanks and praise. For in a time like this, we need to stick closer to Jesus. Amen. We need to hold on to his hand. You know, a lot of times you might have trouble at work, trouble in your home, even trouble at church. But we need to stick to Jesus. Because at the end of the journey, we want to hear, well done. We don't want to waste our time. I see a lot of folks who I grew up in the church, and they could be my grandmother. And then I see children who I have left who are uh, ministering now. We don't want to be here for 20 years, 50 years, and we hear depart from us. I do not know you. We do not want to become a church for our brothers and sisters. If it's if it's only church we come in, stop. Get your hearts and your mind cemented upon Jesus. Because the day is going to come. We might not be in the number when the trumpet sounds, but one day our number is going to be called. And when we leave this world, always preach and say, there is no repentance in the grave. Anywhere the tree lies, there it is going to stay. Until the day of judgment. 
So what's the best thing we can do? Get our hearts right with the Lord. I greet all of you for those um, older folks. I used to sit over here with the older folks. And this used to be the young people seat. Amen. I, I see my classmate. I saw you on television. I said, oh, I see a lot of you. I want to encourage you to keep on keeping on. I look over there. I said, that's Sister Dougie. Amen. Bless the name of the Lord. I want you to keep on keeping on and hold on to Christ Jesus because there is no better. There is no better than Jesus. God bless you. I love all of you with the love of the Lord. Thank you, Brother Seymour. Continue working for the Lord. And now invite the choir to come and minister unto us.
Hallelujah. If Jesus kept all his promises to you, let me hear a hallelujah. Yes, he's a man that cannot break his promises and he will not break his promises. If he promised you something and you don't get it, it's your fault and my fault. He always keeps his promise. Just before I hand over to our dear pastor, I'm going to share a little poem with you. But you have to help me through the poem. The title of the poem is Jesus Christ, Emmanuel. And I am going to show you the letters. You are going to tell me what the letters are, and I will read what the letters are saying to us. The first one. Uno no sound so strong. Thank you. Journeying to Bethlehem, a long and tiring road. This one. Every bed was full that night, no matter where they checked. Stable is empty, someone said. A place to lay your head. Until a baby was born in there, a manger for a bed. Someone special and holy, the angels said. Christened Emmanuel, a name chosen by God. How noble for one born in a situation so odd. Remembered now in prayers and churches all around the world. Immortalized in stories and songs learned by every boy and girl. Sacrificed upon the cross to forgive us all our sins. The Son of God who was born for us, who died and was born again. Let me hear the two words that you saw on the paper. What are they? The two names. Shout his name, man. Another time. God bless you as you turn your heart and listen to the word, we now invite Pastor Robinson to come and give us the word. Praise the Lord. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Can I give the Lord praise? Is he worthy to be praised? Amen. Praise the Lord. It's good to Amen. Always good feeling to Tabernacle with our brothers and sisters. Amen. It's good to see everyone in this season. Amen. Amen. I greet moderator this morning. Amen. 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 Bless the Lord. Amen. He plays the job well. Amen. It's a team. Amen. I don't know what his wife plays or she sings. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. But it's good that you work together. I greet my wife also. She's here. I told you. I should be back soon and she's with the Christmas. Amen. Praise the Lord and the boys are here. I, I tell you, if you're not married, okay, when Christmas comes, you kind of feel a little bit lonely. Amen. But if you're married and you're better half, is with you, I feel a little more comfortable. Because the, 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 the little goodies I'm talking about. <laughs> Amen. Praise the Lord. All these little goodies, you will see, and you will see the place look a little bit different from when like we're doing it. Amen. Praise the Lord. And it's good to have you 
my brothers and sisters visiting friends with us this morning. Amen. Uh, it's always Christmas is a family. Family together. It's always a good thing. Amen. Praise the Lord. So I'm happy to be with this big family also. They're my family. Amen. We are all the children of God. Amen. Praise the Lord. I want to just give a quick reminder this evening. Having a word. Let children that way. That's it. It's there. Let's use it that way. But the children will be performing some of the adults. We'll be doing a little choral service. Amen. And, and, and just enjoying our hearts. Enjoying the self this evening. But next week, Monday, it will be the children treat. Start at four. And then in the later part, then we go. In the later part, we have a gospel concert. We'll make some money. All right? Praise the Lord. And I'm just reminding Sister Reed. Praise the Lord. That, that, that. The song you just sang, Jesus kept all his promises. And I hear the choir director was emphasizing. Promises, 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 amen. Jesus kept his promises. And we want to do the same, amen. Amen. Let me also do recognize those different, different hands and different God. Praise the Lord. And you, related to Brother Mason. Brother Mason, can I? I want to recognize yes, please stand. Okay. Let's recognize the, the, you know daughter, the, the, all three daughters. Yes. Robinson. Bless the name of Jesus. Amen. It, 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 it's good to have. And, and notice that he, he just just same colors like that. That is not wonderful. <laughs> Amen. Praise the Lord. Give them a hand, man. Praise the Lord. Amen. Glory to God. You may be seated. Amen. Be two recommendations. name of Jesus. Amen. Turn it me to Old Testament, to Isaiah 9. I'm just going to read one verse. Could, I could almost say the gospel of Isaiah. Amen. Praise the Lord. Isaiah chapter 9, verse 6. Straight. For unto us a child is born. Unto us a son is given. And the government shall be upon his shoulder. And his name shall be called Wonderful Counselor, the Mighty God, the Everlasting Father, and the Prince of Peace. Father, I honor you. I praise you. I glorify your name. Lord, we thank you again for another Lord's day. Lord, we thank you for this gracious privilege you have given that we us that we can come again in your house together to worship and to praise you and to lift up your mighty name. Lord, we thank you for your loving kindness towards us. The promises are sure they are true. You never leave us, nor forsake us. Lord, I pray you may give us receptive hearts. Hallelujah. To receive your word. In the mighty name of Jesus, receive the glory and the honor and the praise now. Amen. Amen. Somebody lift your hands and praise the Lord. Amen. When I come to church, I always tell you, I come for no other reason but to worship the Lord. I, 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 I grow. 
when I hear folks saying iron sharpness iron. But I, I was wondering until I become an adult, I real, realized that a file is a piece of iron sharpening a knife or a machine. Amen. So when as believers we come together, we come to sharp each other. The Bible says the word of God is more powerful than a two-edged sword, sharper than any two-edged sword. Amen. Praise the Lord. So the word of God can cut, it can pierce, and it heal. Amen. And it save and it justify and it sanctify. Amen. Somebody. And the word provides. Amen. It brings comfort also. That's the word. It's sharp. Amen. So when we come, we come to shop for each other. Amen. For the season. Amen. Praise the Lord. Glory to God. Amen. See, when I come and I call this, my thought thing is that the dead cannot praise God. Amen. The grave cannot celebrate our God. Amen. When someone dies, you, 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 the time is up for praising God. That's why every opportunity I get, I praise God. Even if I'm alone, I just praise God. Somebody praise God. Hallelujah. Somebody lift your hands uh, and give the Lord praise and give him glory and give him honor. Glory to God. Amen. Praise the Lord. I want to speak to us today on this topic of seed of a woman. For this season. Amen. The seed of a woman. The word seed means an offspring or a descendants. Now I am a seed, the robins. Amen. I'm an offspring, the robins is family. Also, I'm an offspring of the family of God. Now, if you look at the text, we speak of the seed of a woman. Uh, medically, they will tell you that a woman does not carry a seed. Amen, somebody. But God described his son coming to a virgin birth. And he described that this son will be the seed, the conception will be the seed of a woman. Amen, somebody. That means there will be no contamination of his product. Amen, somebody. And so that Jesus, amen, was conceived through the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen, somebody. And so, read the Bible in Genesis 3, 15. Ah, God said, hallelujah, when man sinned, when the hurt entered into darkness, because we got to understand that after Adam and Eve have given up their rights to serve God, did you know that they give up their rights to, to serve God and to have a, a communion and fellowship with God. Uh, and that's why the Bible said when Adam and Eve are fallen, God came down in the cool of the day, the same time which you'd come down every day to pay visit, uh, to have communion and to talk uh, and to fellowship with Adam and Eve. Uh, and when he came maybe to the same place uh, where he used to meet them, they were not there in their position yeah. are in the same condition he left them the day uh, yeah. before uh, yeah. and he said Adam where uh, art thou uh, yeah. and he uh, you know hear me somebody Adam where art thou uh, yeah. immediately Adam begin uh, yeah. to tell God about his struggles and his problem uh, yeah. you see uh, yeah. I was naked uh, yeah. And I am hiding because I am naked. Uh, yeah. I, uh, you can't look at me uh, yeah. in this condition. Uh, yeah. You see, 
hallelujah, that the fool, that they, that God, uh, when he sees Adam, uh, he did not see him as naked. Uh, and when Adam of communion with God, uh, Adam did not see himself uh, as being naked. Uh. Anybody understand what I'm talking about? Uh? And so then God, uh, God made provision uh, that man could come back to him. Uh. You see, God is a loving God. Uh. God will not forsake man uh, forever. Uh. Amen, somebody. That's why we can hear uh, today, uh, even in our sorrows, uh, to praise God uh, and to give him glory uh, and to give him honor uh, and to give him praise. Uh. So the provision was made for man, for you and I. Uh, Oh, and I will put enmity between uh, thee uh, and her seed. Uh, notice this. And her seed. Uh, talking about Jesus. Uh, the seed uh, of the woman. Uh, the seed of Mary. Uh, amen, somebody. And it shall bruise uh, his head. Uh, hallelujah. That Jesus, the seed of the woman, uh, would crush the head uh, of the serpent. Uh, would crush the head uh, of the devil. Uh, you see, that's why uh, you and I are saved. Uh, because Jesus Christ uh, reigns supreme. Uh, anybody know that Jesus Christ, uh, hallelujah, that's why it says uh, when, hallelujah, that to his disciples, uh, hallelujah, I have power, uh, amen, somebody to lay down my life uh, and to pick it up again, uh, amen, somebody. Uh, so Jesus of authority uh, because he is God uh, and God alone. Uh, and he shall bruise my uh, head, and thou shalt bruise his heel. Uh, that means you gotta understand that Calvary, uh, what the devil did. Uh, amen. He could not crush the head of Jesus. Uh, hallelujah. But he, hallelujah. He, he rejoiced to see Jesus uh, crucified, died, uh, laid in the tomb. Uh, my brothers and sisters, uh, this was a promise uh, which was made uh, for man uh, when Adam fall uh, from grace with God. Uh, somebody give God praise. Uh, hallelujah. After the fall of man, the peace of creation was disturbed uh, and its beauty stained with sin. Give me a few minutes. You see, Adam, before sin, uh, I've never experienced rain. You have never experienced a earthquake. Hallelujah. Never experience a tornado. Oh, God. Uh, are you with me, somebody? Uh, the earth was perfect. Uh, Adam could have walked. Uh, you know, this uh, recently, in a couple of years, uh, they're saying that we should leave meat, uh, eat fruits and vegetables. Uh, all the fruits and vegetables was there uh, in the garden uh, that Adam could have kept all the days uh, because God has kept his promises to him uh, that I'm going to supply uh, all your needs uh, according to my riches uh, in glory. Uh. So the creation was now uh, disturbed uh, because of sin. Uh. Oh, can I preach for a few more minutes? Uh. You see, uh, creation is disturbed. Uh. We are in a season uh, all your uh, Christmas season, uh, but many hearts is fearful uh, because the oh, hallelujah creation is disturbed uh, because criminals uh, they meant somebody uh, they meant church of the living God uh, are doing what they want to do. Uh, we still have in earth and flood rain in this season. Lives have been lost, but before man would live forever. Hallelujah. God immediately proceed to pass sentence upon man. You with me, somebody? In spite, God passed a sentence in Genesis 6, Genesis 6. 
God said, my spirit uh, will not strive uh, with man uh, at all times. Uh, your heel shall be uh, 120. Uh, oh, you know, hear me somebody. So God said that man, because of sin, uh, man would die. Uh, you see, we experience all of this. Uh, but God makes a provision uh, that we may have life uh, and have it more uh, abundantly. Uh, there is hope in Jesus uh, in this season. Uh, hello, somebody. Uh, if you are living without Christ, uh, there is hope. Uh, oh, hallelujah. There is hope uh, in this season for you. Hallelujah. But God still have love for man. Isaiah 7 verse 4 says, Therefore, the Lord himself shall give you a sign. The old of virgin shall conceive and bear a son, and his name shall be called, somebody call his name, Emmanuel, being God with us. So I can't understand at times somebody's asking, Who oh, is Jesus? Hallelujah. Is Jesus God? But, oh, hallelujah. But Isaiah pencil this uh, almost 2,000 years uh, before uh, that God will send forth uh, Emmanuel, uh, mean God uh, is with us. Uh, so when Jesus came, uh, he was God uh, with us. Uh, when Jesus, uh, hallelujah, uh, oh hallelujah, was conceived uh, by the Holy Spirit uh, in the womb uh, of Mary, uh, he was God uh, in the womb whom uh, uh, Mary, uh, the virgin, somebody, uh, so it was God, uh, God with us, uh, hallelujah, God with us, amen, somebody, there is a continual conflict between grace uh, and corruption, in the hearts of men, uh, my brothers and sisters, uh, we can see today uh, there's always a line uh, between the just uh, and the unjust. Uh, there's always a conflict uh, between the righteous uh, and the unrighteous. Uh, are you with somebody? Uh, oh, glory to God. Uh, but God has made a promise uh, to his people. Uh, are you one of his sons and daughters? Uh, hallelujah. I promise. Uh, We'll never leave you, nor forsake you. Hallelujah. There is always, likewise, uh, a continual struggle uh, between the wicked uh, and the godly uh, in this world today. Uh, you see, Jesus said uh, to us uh, that if we love the world, uh, you got to understand what was saying. Uh, it's not mean that you should walk naked. Uh, you don't eat food, uh, but don't place emphasis uh, on the world goods uh, and what is taking place. Uh, my brothers and sisters, uh, you see, if we love the world, world today. Uh, we may be in town uh, doing all what we want to do uh, and forsake the assembly uh, of the believers uh, because we are thinking about uh, this day Christmas. Uh, but I come to tell somebody, uh, I want to blow your mind this morning. Uh, amen. Somebody, uh, Jesus came uh, to save man. Uh, hello, somebody. Uh, Christmas is for the merchants. Uh, a little sailor uh, of the goods. Uh, to get rich, uh, amen, somebody, uh, but for you and I, uh, we celebrate the coming uh, of Jesus Christ uh, to save us uh, from sin, uh, to save us uh, from this ungodly world. Uh. Hello. Oh, glory to God. You see Christmas? Uh, amen, somebody. Uh, it's a one of the Roman son, uh, hallelujah, they uh, celebrate his birthday. Uh, yeah. And so, hallelujah, uh, yeah. they begin to join it with Christ. Uh, yeah. Today, don't come to celebrate uh, Christmas.
Christmas in that context. Uh, I am celebrating uh, Christmas uh, to say thank you, Lord, uh, for coming down. Uh, thank you, Lord. Uh, hallelujah to remember me. Uh, can I tell somebody uh, before the foundation uh, of the earth, I can say thank you, Lord, uh, for coming down uh, to save me. Uh, but before the foundation uh, of the earth, uh, God knew me. Uh, he knew my name. Uh, he knew the family. Uh, can I preach up here a little bit? Uh, that's why I tell somebody the other day, uh, anybody commit a passion, uh, commit murder, uh, because that child, uh, oh, you don't hear me, somebody, have a name uh, and have a family uh, before the foundation uh, of the world. Uh, can I talk up here? Uh, I said before, uh, God said to Jeremiah, uh, oh, Jeremiah, uh, I knew you uh, before uh, you were conceived uh, in your mother's womb. Uh, all of us here, God know your family. Uh, it doesn't matter how you come uh, out of wedlock. Uh, in marriage, God knows uh, that you would be here uh, to give him praise uh, and to give him glory. Uh, somebody lift your hand and praise him. Uh, so before the foundation, God uh, form you, uh, and him call me Brian, uh, him call me Michael, uh, him call me Augustus, uh, him call me Robbins, uh, oh you don't hear me, somebody, uh, amen somebody, uh, somebody praise him, uh, don't worry yourself uh, about uh, what type of family you have, uh, because before the foundation God set you up and place you there so he will take care of you. Tell your neighbor, uh, he will take care of you. Uh, so he knows where you are. Uh, he knows your down setting. Uh, he knows your uprising. Uh, my brothers and sisters, uh, they meant somebody. Uh, you got to understand the God uh, we serve. Uh, somebody praise him. Hallelujah. So I said, Hallelujah. A gracious promise is made. A Christ Jesus uh, as the deliverer of a fallen man. Notice this. Moses came as a deliverer. Visible. I mean, somebody that they could see the children uh -huh. yeah. of Israel, the Hebrew could see him. Uh -huh. Hallelujah. Uh, came in uh, to Egypt to deliver them. Uh, out of bondage, uh, watch this. Uh, Jesus uh, could have came down as a spirit, uh, but we could not see the spirit. Uh, they meant somebody. Uh, so he stepped down uh, in a body uh, that we can see him, uh, that the disciples could handle him, uh, that they could eat with him, uh, that they could drink with him. Uh, this is Saint Jesus. Uh, I'm talking about uh, that's why uh, that the disciples were sad uh, when he was going back to glory uh, because they had good fellowship uh, with Jesus. Uh, and while they uh, when he was leaving, uh, you all in the angels, uh, I believe, uh, hallelujah, that's the same angels. Uh, they came down and said to us, uh, God is with us, uh, his name shall be called uh, Emmanuel. Uh, God is with us. Uh, hallelujah, the Bible says uh, that the disciples saw, uh, hallelujah, Jesus going up, uh, and the angels uh, in white linen uh, stood up in mid glory uh, and said, Amen, uh, of Galilee. Uh, why stand there uh, gazing up uh, into heaven? Uh, for this same Jesus, uh, you see, uh, lead you, uh, shall return uh, like man. Uh, this same Jesus, uh, hallelujah, uh, came uh, into this world uh, in the full body uh, of man and God, uh, shall return uh, one of these days. Uh, somebody praise him, uh, he will keep. Uh, all his promises. Oh, glory to God. Saint Jesus. The door of hope was open to man. And then somebody look at the neighbor and neighbor. This a door of hope was open to you and I. That we can just walk in. 
meant somebody. <laughs> yeah. Hallelujah. That we can walk in. <laughs> it meant somebody. That's why the Bible said, you know, <laughs> they want you gotta walk in and talk to the high priest. <laughs> and the high priest <laughs> would have to get a lama <laughs> or a ram or a bullock. Uh, yeah. or some turtle dog uh, yeah. and you got to do his thing uh, yeah. but the Bible says when Jesus died uh, yeah. the veil of the temple uh, yeah. just like a piece of curtain here uh, yeah. was ripped in two uh, yeah. a piece of curtain was torn in two uh, yeah. oh you don't hear me somebody uh, yeah. that you and I can walk in uh, yeah. anytime uh, yeah. I can walk in uh, yeah. at midnight uh, yeah. amen somebody uh, yeah. I can walk in uh, yeah. Hallelujah. Uh, yeah. And I can talk to Jesus uh, yeah. anytime. Uh, yeah. Anytime. Uh, yeah. Amen. Somebody. Uh, yeah. Anytime. Tell your neighbor. Anytime. Uh, yeah. I can walk in. Uh, yeah. Anytime. Uh, yeah. That's the hope I have. Uh, yeah. In Jesus Christ. Uh, yeah. I have hope to walk in. Uh, yeah. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Uh, yeah. That's the reason. This is the reason yeah. of my Christian. Uh, that I can walk in uh, and talk with Jesus. Uh, somebody said, just uh, a little talk uh, with Jesus. Uh, make it right. Uh, come on, church of the living God. Just a little talk. In this season, I mean, somebody, hallelujah, door is open. In this prophecy, for us, the coming of the Messiah. Isaiah said, for unto us. When you notice this, a child is born. Now this is flesh. The son of Mary. Amen, somebody. The child of Mary. Are you in this somebody? Come with me in this. This is now the child of Mary. So God separate uh, the child uh, from the son. Uh, yeah. Come on, somebody, different type of theology. This past yeah. how that work. Uh, God separate uh, yeah. the child uh, from the son. Uh, yeah. Oh God, uh, yeah. Mary's child uh, would not give up uh, his life uh, for my sin, uh, for the son of God uh, would give up uh, his life uh, for my sin. Uh, somebody praise him. Amen, somebody. Hallelujah. Child is born unto us a son. Is given. Remember, what God said in Genesis, when he said, Go, let us make man. Hallelujah. He speak of the Trinity. Hello, somebody. Come. Let us, uh, the Trinity, uh, in different dispensation now. Uh, yeah. Oh God, uh, yeah. we speak of the Son of God uh, came in the flesh. Uh, yeah. Amen. Manifest himself uh, yeah. in the flesh uh, yeah. as God uh, yeah. with us. Uh, yeah. Oh, somebody praise him up here. Uh, yeah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Uh, yeah. When Nebuchadnezzar uh, yeah. told the three Hebrew boys uh, yeah. in the fire, uh, yeah. anybody in this season, uh, yeah. are you in your fire? Uh, yeah. Oh, hallelujah. Yeah. The Son of God uh, yeah. is with you. Uh, yeah. Oh, you hallelujah. Nebuchadnezzar says, uh, I need not show uh, three men in the fire. Uh, yeah. But when I look in the fire, uh, yeah. it's just like a season like this. Uh, yeah. I see four men. Uh, yeah. Oh, uh, uh, you don't hear me, somebody yeah. in the fire. Uh, yeah. And they were, were not just tied up uh, yeah. and found love. Uh, yeah. They were loose. Uh, yeah. Having a little party uh, yeah. in the fire. Uh, yeah. Anybody up here understand uh, yeah. what I'm talking about? Uh, yeah. They all glory to God. Uh, yeah. Oh, hallelujah. Yeah. They were in the fire, uh, yeah. but Jesus stepped out uh, yeah. of glory, uh, yeah. manifest himself uh, yeah. to Nebuchadnezzar. Uh, yeah. Are you with me, somebody? Yeah. Is he manifesting yeah. himself uh, yeah. to the Holy Spirit? Uh, yeah. To you, uh, yeah. amen, somebody. Uh, yeah. So the Bible says uh, yeah. that Nebuchadnezzar said, I see four men uh, yeah. walking in the 
fire uh, and they will lose uh, for the Bible says uh, who the son uh, set free uh, is free uh, indeed uh, hello somebody uh, Glory, glory to God. Uh, we shall have some free people uh, to praise God. Uh, if Jesus cut, if Jesus cut you free, uh, praise him. Uh, hello, somebody. Uh, when, oh, hallelujah. When he came down uh, in the fire uh, and lose those boys, uh, they did not sit there. Uh, they got up uh, and started to walk. Hello. Folks, the best time to walk when you're in your fire. <laughs> I'm out, God, oh God, oh God. The best time to celebrate God uh, is when you're in your fire. <laughs> the best time to celebrate God uh, is when you're in your valley. Uh, hello, church of the living God. I say the best time to praise God. Uh, So the Son of God came down, started walking the fire with them. Somebody said, He abides. <laughs> he abides. <laughs> Hallelujah. Are you in your fire? He abides. Glory, 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 glory. 
his counselor. Uh, yeah. When you go to him uh, yeah. in prayer uh, yeah. and you lock yourself uh, yeah. in your closet, uh, yeah. he will minister to you uh, yeah. and you can come back out. Uh, yeah. Somebody uh, yeah. got to understand. Uh, yeah. He knows your problems. Uh, yeah. he, hallelujah. Yeah. He cares for you. Uh, yeah. He will talk to you. Uh, said you need a counselor. Uh, you need to talk to Jesus. Uh, and he will bring you out. Uh, he will tell you what to do. Oh, glory, glory. Glory, glory. You see, the world uh, was in a dark uh, and terrible uh, place. Uh, you need somebody uh, to stand up to shine uh, the light. Uh, amen. Somebody. Uh, Jesus is the light uh, of the world. Uh, are you with me? Somebody. Uh, hallelujah. He is uh, the mighty God. Uh, amen. Somebody. There is no other God uh, like Jehovah God. Uh, can I tell somebody? Somebody, uh, yeah. uh, maybe I tell you already. Uh, yeah. uh, my mechanic, uh, yeah. I will give me a little fun, a little pickup uh, yeah. to drive to buy uh, yeah. something one day. Uh, yeah. When I got in it, uh, yeah. I stepped back out. Uh, yeah. I said, I'm not going to drive this vehicle. Uh, yeah. Because when I look, uh, yeah. I see a little elephant uh, yeah. into a little box. Uh, yeah. It was an Indian man vehicle. Uh, yeah. So he placed his little guard uh, yeah. in front of him. Uh, yeah. So every where he's driving, uh, that little car uh, yeah. is driving alongside with him uh, yeah. and guiding him. Uh, yeah. But can I tell somebody, yeah. he's a mighty God. Uh, his name is Jesus. Uh, he's above Buddha. Uh, he's above Krishna. Uh, he's, oh, you know, hear me, somebody. Uh, he's above all other gods. Uh, they may tell uh, all other gods. Uh, they're the works of men. Uh, they may somebody. Uh, no other God can heal you. Uh, no other God can forgive sin. Uh, no other God can set you free. Uh, you know, hear me, church of the living God. That's why we praise him uh, in this season uh, because he is uh, the true and living God. Give me a few moments. Oh God, oh God. He's a mighty God. He is the everlasting Father without ending. Uh, I said, oh, Our Father uh, is without ending. Uh, yeah. So, my. Biological father, buried on a hurry. More power. Hallelujah. He had an end. But I have a father uh, who have no end in. Uh, yeah. I can call upon him anytime uh, yeah. and say, Fix it for me, daddy. Fix it. Fix it. Fix it. Fix it. Fix it for me. Yeah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Somebody told yourself, yeah. I don't know what I'm talking. Say, Fix it for me, daddy. Yeah. Just fix it. Fix it for me. Yeah. Fix it. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Uh, yeah. That's the part that we serve. Uh. Yeah. Amen. Somebody. Uh. Yeah. You see, when the disciples ask him, yeah. because John taught his disciples to pray, uh. yeah. yo, the 12 said, uh, yeah. oh, teach us to pray. Jesus said, oh, I'm fine. Uh, uh, what in heaven? Somebody understand that. Yeah. I am. Uh, be your name holy is your name. Uh, yeah. Somebody got to understand that the Father, that's God, uh, yeah. we serve. Uh, yeah. Amen. Somebody here. Yeah. Uh, holy is his name. Uh, yeah. You and I can contaminate our God uh, yeah. because he's God. Uh, yeah. He's holy. Uh, yeah. He's righteous. Uh, yeah. He's above principalities. Uh, yeah. He's above powers. Uh, yeah. He's above rulers of darkness. Uh, yeah. He's above every idea uh, yeah. that exalts its knowledge. Uh, yeah. That's the God we serve. Uh, yeah. He is the mighty God. Uh, somebody praise our God. Uh, somebody praise uh, the mighty God. Uh, somebody praise uh, the everlasting Father. Hallelujah. And as I went on to write, uh, he is the prince of peace. Watch this. I don't understand. I don't understand. Then the king uh, is riding in town uh, and his horse. Uh, yeah. He has a uh, breastplate. Uh, yeah. You don't hear me, somebody. Yeah. Something on the spirit. Yeah. Something on the speed. Uh, yeah. Amen. And they had sword. Uh, yeah. So an ass represents the battle. Uh, 
uh, ready to war. Uh, up and harm at war. Uh, when a king ride in town, uh, sometimes person beaten. Uh, maybe they say they're going to come to war us. Uh, my God, my God. Uh, but the Bible said Jesus came in uh, as the Prince of Peace. Uh, amen, church of the living God. Uh, so the Bible says uh, that he came in riding uh, on a donkey. Uh, signify peace. Uh, somebody say peace. Uh, peace. Uh, hallelujah. Peace. Uh, that's what Jesus brings. Uh, peace. Uh, hallelujah. Luke says uh, glory to God uh, in the highest. Uh, and on earth, uh, peace. Uh, somebody said peace. Uh, show peace. Uh, amen. Uh, you can show to get this peace uh, that I have. Uh, the world did not give it to me. Uh, and the world cannot take it away. Uh, but the word of God says uh, peace on earth, goodwill uh, to all men. That means I am included. Touch yourself. Uh, I said, I am included. <laughs> I'm included. I'm included. <laughs> I'm included. <laughs> For the peace of God, pass it. <laughs> All understanding. <laughs> Bigger than with knowledge. Bigger than with knowledge. Bigger than with knowledge. Tell your neighbor, the peace of God, pass it. <laughs> That, that would be clarification. Anybody, anything at all. But it passed not. Peace of God passed not. That's why when I read the scripture, I, I said, God, you know you mean this. Huh? He said, if me ways, please, me not your ways. Me not your ways. Me not my ways. He said, Rabbi. Remember, no, me never said, hey, me, are you, you know? <laughs> Oh God, you'll leave and say, Pastor, see you. He said, Me, God, the word of God said to me, He said, Rabbi, if your ways please me, even your enemy, will be at peace with your Rabbi. So when your enemy, them see you, then run, come and say, What? Rabbit, uh, glory to God, glory to God. I don't know about you, uh, but my God, peace pass at all understanding. Uh, amen, somebody. Uh, so when me wish, please, God, uh, even if you have something against me, when you see me, you have to just love me. Uh, can I preach up here? The Bible says so. Say the peace of God. Somebody say the peace of God. Somebody show the peace of God. Somebody shouted. So that's why any man write this song. Peace of God. Covered me through the storm. <laughs> Peace of God. <laughs> Cover me. Only, only in you, only in you, I see joy, only in you, I find peace, so cover me, as a prince of peace, cover me, somebody should stand a prince of peace, Oh, 
Wewe was confusion.
Somebody praise the Lord. Somebody praise the Lord. Somebody praise the Lord. Somebody praise the Lord. Glorify the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Redemption is in this house. For such a message, anyone you are not saved, I would invite you to come right now. You are not saved. If the trumpet should sound right now, if the trumpet should sound right now, would you be in that number? brothers and sisters, salvation is in the house. Get up and come. Hallelujah. Bless the Lord. Amen. Come young man. Come young man. Come young man. Hallelujah. Do we have anybody else? You are not saved. You are not saved. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Another one, you are not saved. You are not saved. I am we are the prayer mothers. We are all the prayer mothers. Place before you. 
body come for salvation. Lord, you said if we come, you will not cast us out. And so, God, hallelujah, we thank you. Oh, God, that we have ears to hear because you said, he that has an ear, let him hear. Oh, God, what the Spirit says unto the church. And this morning, hallelujah, we thank you, God, for good hearers. They come for salvation. Save them, God, to the utmost. Hallelujah, touch them, Lord, from the crown of their head to the very sole of their feet. God, you're a God of love. You're a God of mercy. Oh, God, we thank you, Lord. That mercy door is still open. Oh, God, you said that millions should come. There is still room for one. We thank you, Lord, for these who have come. And so, God, we pray may wash away their sin. Oh, God, cleanse them, Lord, from all unrighteousness. Oh, God, purge them, Lord. Amen. Let them be clean, eternal God. Hallelujah, to become a worker for you. Hallelujah, before the time, amen, come to an end. And so, Lord, amen, touch them, Lord. Touch their families. Oh, God, the preacher says, before they even were conceived, before their mother even knew their father, you knew them by name and by number. Oh, God, it was not coincidence that they came this morning. But it was ordained and orchestrated by you, Lord. And we thank you, Lord, that you have yielded to the call. God, we give you glory. We give you honor and praise. In Jesus' name, amen and amen. Do we have one who would confess Jesus Christ as Lord? If you confess him as Lord, come right up here. If you decide to walk with Jesus this morning, this afternoon, amen, take a bold step. Hallelujah. Come out from among them. Amen. Hallelujah. Let me tell you, time is short. Time is very short. And, uh, and, and a lot of folks say we, we preach in doom and gloom, but it is a very short thing. Life is so uncertain. You see me today, you don't see me tomorrow. But that is a sure thing. The Bible said, small and great were standing before God. And a book was open. Another book was open. Hallelujah. And whose names were not found in the book of life. They were cast in the lake of fire. Isaiah says, the dead cannot celebrate him. He says, the grave cannot praise him. But he says, you are living. You're alive. Hallelujah. You can feel the blood running warm in your vein. He says, you can praise him. Why not make it a choice today? Why not make it a choice today? Today is the day of salvation. He says, come. Hallelujah. Yes, young lady. What hinder you from coming? You know that every excuse that we can, we can think about and come up with can't save God. What hinder you from giving your life to the Lord this morning? What hinder you? You're knocking at your heart. Says, come. Anything that is a burden, Jesus is a burden bearer. Hallelujah. Anything that you think is weighing you down, that you can't come, Jesus says, you come unto me because my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Hallelujah. What's weighing you down? Hallelujah. We have a prayer, mothers. We are my prayer mothers. Hallelujah. So clear and tenderly. Rest your hand on this, this young lady in the green. She's been troubled by the spirit.
one church pray. This is prayer time. We have people in travail at the altar. It's time for you to pray. Hallelujah.
Oh God, we thank you, God, for what even what you're about to do. Holy Spirit, rain down. Rain down on your people. Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. Rain down on your people. Holy Spirit, arrest those hearts that are halting between two opinions at this time. Oh God, we send out the Holy Spirit for a curfew. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Oh, we come against you, Satan. Take your hands of God's property. In the name of Jesus. Oh, Satan, you are defeated this morning, this afternoon, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Satan, you cannot win. Oh, God. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. We are victorious. In the name of Jesus. We are victorious. In the name of Jesus. Victorious. In the name of Jesus. Victorious in the name of Jesus. Victorious in the name of Jesus. Oh, we plead the blood of Jesus. Oh, we plead the blood of Jesus. Oh, we plead the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. When it comes to the work of God, we have no time. Glory to God. We work it with time when it comes to the work of God. Do we have anyone else in the audience who need a special prayer? You can come where the Holy Spirit is dealing with these at the altar. You need a special prayer. Hallelujah. Let your voice be heard. Come and change your heart. I stand on your word. Holy Change our hearts and 
as we stand on your word, Holy Spirit, rain and dry. Holy Spirit, rain. Primary school children, the devil is targeting. Come on, people, we need to wake up and, and, and put a covering over our children. Our children are not too young to serve the Lord. There's mommy. Come on. Mommy's here. Let him feel a mother's love. Even God's love is even more greater. Let him feel that love. If that love feels so nice, Omar, can you imagine Jesus rubbing his arms around you at your tender age of 12? Yeah. Uh -huh. 
Shout hallelujah. hallelujah. Somebody give Jesus praise. Give me some Jesus. Talk to Jesus. Hallelujah. Somebody give Jesus praise. Hallelujah. We bless Thank the Lord, Lord for today. We bless you, Lord. Is God with us? Hallelujah. To save and to set men free. Amen. It's not by might, not by power. But by the Holy Spirit, just want to thank the Lord. 
interaction with your discussion with these folks and I tell you my brothers and sisters I tell you that Holy Spirit he does some stuff sometimes you know that's why man cannot understand what, 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 what Sister Rob what's the first name Valerie, not today, but the Holy Spirit. So today I'm calling you. If you hear me, harden up your heart, not stick that you neck. Because see what the Holy Spirit does? When the Holy Spirit slays you, you get up back. That means a new beginning. A change. That's why I put you down. To bring change. Some of us still want God drugs, you know. We must believe that. You know what I drop. But when you go down, you come back up stronger. Amen, somebody. She didn't know. She, she couldn't stop for the God. So the Lord visit you today. The Holy Spirit to save you. Because he sees that you are lost. Him. And he want to transform you to give you hope, to give you eternal life now. Glory to God. Somebody say glory to God. Come here, Rabbi. Talk to him. Come here, brother. Time to understand. You have a right to cry. Come on, come and hug them. Welcome them to your family. Your daughters, you know. But when they get saved, it's a different family. You know, you know, it 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 is a sponsor. Amen. Praise God. And this young lady is your words. The mom of this young lady. Your daughter, man. Your young lady sit down here. Come here. I just want to ask you one question. You have always yeah. I, let me tell you something. Sometimes people when I talk to people, I can't say this. Not to somebody that somebody before. The young lady was You know the problem is, none of us want to bury our children. Grocery debt. Mm -hmm. Don't have them I know your fund very much. Stop running to your man. Amen. Praise the Lord. And then we can talk. All right. Personal. Abuse. 
Come down to your own. Let's go more study time. Tell me when you are feeling better. Amen. So, put it on there for the time. You, you, you don't know that. Don't worry yourself. Do not. Do not. Praise the Lord. Come on. Somebody give the Lord praise. For what the word of God says, when one sinner repents, that's the difficulty, you know. The angels rejoice. That's a hard to command. To give their heart to the Lord. Because the battle is your fight. To give their heart. To give their heart. You know what the devil tells me, brother, minister Seymour? Um, you know, you have enough time. So give the Lord your heart to you. I said, okay, 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 okay. don't get saved today. Here and next week, and then next week, come and say, no, wait for the other week. And 20 years go by when you lose your mind. Okay, not but there's a if you have an open door, walk through. But one of these days that door will be there is one more thing that will be very difficult. Read Bible speak of the ten verses. Five was wise, five was foolish. So what happened? Five was cut out. The door just came. I believe. That is out of five virgins inside, you know. But I put it on. I have good intention. When I hear the man knock, then I open the door. But that door was closed just like when God locked up the door. God took the key that. When now I see man, they join him. So are you, man, I said, come to it. Come to it, come to it, Rabbi. But God locked it and said, I have the key. It's sealed. Here's a day coming, a sin day coming. I'm going to show you those two scenarios. Here's a third scenario coming. When God is going to close the door. Open. It is open today. Wow. Remember this week, it is coming. Enjoy the place where it's going to come. It's not high yet. So why do we have money to take this? Amen. Praise the Lord. And those who are in the choir, come with the song. Because if you don't come, it comes to the choir members and other people, then you have to play the song again. So, Sister Martin, look to the choir members and say, The pastor, the one you know, Pastor. And we believe that. Amen. Praise the Lord. So, please. And for Mark, put up your say, let's say, yeah. The team is let's celebrate. Please. So come out and celebrate. Amen. So if, so what I'm saying, if you have broke pocket, come. And if your pocket full of money, come. Praise the Lord. God bless you. Stand with me. Amen. Thanks again for coming. Thanks for all our visits. That thank you, Minister Nelson and your family. Amen and others. God bless you. Those who are online, we thank you. God bless you. Benediction. Nobody saving grace for Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Love of God is by the full fellowship of the Holy Spirit. Rest remain in the Bible, so I'm about now and forevermore. Amen. Amen.